it is Moonlight Fiesta, so basically we have a festival, which is always fun. I always like festivals. Um, the top-up bonus and stuff is kind of cool. You get, you know, this little dancing bunny on a flower. Kind of different. <laughs> um, but of course, just like any of the events that we've had, right, you've basically got your own, you know, uh, well, I guess what you almost equate to a battle pass, basically. Um, they got the sleepyhead action emote within it. And then Light Symphony, you know, obviously if you acquire these, you'll get Dreamer's Lanterns. And then for the lanterns themselves, which you can do during the event, so you've got Power Boost. Second event, you got Beast Slay. Third event, you got Heroes. Fourth event, you got Training Troops. The fifth event, you have Hero Gear. And the sixth, the sixth, eh. sixth event is going to be Gathering. And then the seventh event is going to be Cheap Gear. Okay. Um... The basic gist, though, right, if if you're paying attention, is you get this free stuff. So if you want to log in, you're welcome to, because uh, there's obviously some stuff. You can also grab the Wisp, which is kind of cool. You get, like, this little moon with the bunny for five bucks, which, eh. You know, it's like, that's an option. Um, but, you know, I mean, as far as the event is concerned, yeah, I mean... Basically, it's going right in the middle of our state of power, which is kind of an awkward time. Uh, plus, we've also got Lucky Wheel going on also. So it's it's kind of a loaded event. Obviously, we have Frostfire Mine too. Um, Alliance Championship, Flame of Fangs, Crazy Joe. It's a, it's a loaded week, guys. <laughs> but the, the main gist is with this event in particular, though, is you can basically get the Dreamer's Lanterns and then... That'll get you to where, you know, obviously if you rank and get points and such, then uh, what you can then do is uh, basically the, the little bunnies will get you lower and lower into where eventually what you can do is just basically dump your points into the Harvest Moon Wishes. And this is just, you know, and obviously if you want to, I think you can, you can just hold your thumb on top of this and then an auto that'll kick on if you've got too many of them. So you don't have to, like, tap all the way if you don't want to. Um, but, yeah, then once you do that, you can just collect your rewards. Um, the main thing is this here. You get the little Nimbus Citadel, which is kind of cool. It's like a little... It's like a house with a couple of bunnies playing with a, with a light balloon, I think. <laughs> just kind of different, right? But, in any case, that's pretty much everything you can kind of expect with the Moonlight Festival. I mean, I've... I would say, if anything, guys, you you, you definitely want to, you know, if you haven't been playing, you, know, you might as well come hop on for a bit and say hello to your fellow guildmates. And, you know, you can kind of enjoy some of the bits and pieces of the free event. But that's pretty much it, I mean, as far as what's coming up. So I hope that was a little bit of some insight as to what's going on with the Moonlight Festival. Thank you guys for watching.